Est-ce que le viol yeah. a été utilisé pendant ce conflit comme tactique yeah. 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 The president called the Secretary of State about the safety of Americans in Rwanda. Well, I'm watching the news, but the news was OJ. A million people being killed in 100 days, and it was all OJ. They're going to create this tribunal. They want prosecutors, lawyers, judges, investigators to come together. I was a prosecutor. I was hired as an investigator. I was so excited to have my dream job just a couple years out of law school. People with very little experience can get incredible responsibilities. Every single conflict, if you start asking questions, you will find that sexual violence is used. Why? Because it's an extremely effective tool of conflict. It's as if someone is reached inside of you and someone talk about just pulling out their soul. Les hommes ont violé la femme et son mari était en haut d'un avocat. Voyant ça, il est descendu lui-même pour se faire tuer. When I arrived in Rwanda, many investigators said, we can't be concerned about some women who got raped. We had a genocide down here. Les viols systématiques, les viols collectifs, je ne pense pas que ce soit quelque chose qu'on peut dire, non, ça, ça fait partie de la guerre. C'est une destruction de, de tout un peuple. The issue is, can you relate that sexual violence to this accused? I knew what we were looking for, but it wasn't coming out. We cannot lose this case. We were desperate. I ask you to find Jean-Paul Akiyezu guilty of genocide in all counts for which he is charged. We couldn't see them. They were behind the curtain. Uh, with these uh, pseudonyms, JJ and Anne. We never saw them. Erizina nitwa gamurukiko, nitwa gajiji. Erizina 